One, two, three. I know you requested this meeting so that you could tell me what's been happening since our last meeting. Yeah. So it would be really nice to hear what the situation is now. Yeah. Yeah, um, I think we've, we've sort of made quite a bit of progress since um, I last saw you. And uh, we've, we've been training our learning coaches team and I'm really pleased with the way that's gone. Um, and I feel they've gained confidence in, um, in their coaching skills and they've been coaching each other. And uh, we've managed to set up some um, meetings with them, uh, you know, sort of uh, pre-work uh, meetings uh, so that they can, they can share their ideas and, and get some questions together. Um, and also uh, the two of us uh, uh, are meeting with them each one-to-one. -one. We sort of split them up between us three mm -hmm. each. Um, so uh, I feel we're underway. Okay. Okay. So what impact is it having on the, the, the school and, and, and how you're moving forward with other people? And, you know, how are they making the impact on... You know, on the strategies that you looked at at the very yeah. beginning? I sort of think it's still early days um, in, in terms of impact. I think the initial impact is on them as learning coaches and gaining their confidence and being at a point where they are ready to um, get some volunteers to work with. Um, and that's the way we've gone. We've gone for, for volunteers. Um, so they're going to work with those, those people now uh, to practice their coaching and uh, we are hoping to go in and observe them doing that um, so that they can get some feedback on their coaching skills. Um, yes, yeah, so uh, I think that's, that's where we're up to. Try but I think in, I've got some ideas about I think where we want to go more widely, but I was I was keen to start small mm -hmm. um, and let it ripple out really. So, how soon will you be able to to move it to the next stage? Well, I think we probably need um, they need to find their volunteers, and then I think they want to perhaps two, three volunteers each. And I think they need probably to try and have two or three short sessions mm. with those people around uh, a teaching and learning topic that the coach has chosen. Um, and then review that um, and check that's going all right mm. uh, before we think about what the next steps are going to be. Mm. So I think I'd be wanting to look at a month to six weeks. I don't want to rush it. Yeah. It's too important to not work. Yeah. And so what do you think other people within the organisation will think about that, the time it takes? Yeah. And, and, and how quickly that impact will show? Um, how might that be a yeah. barrier to success yeah. for you? I sort of... You know, when we got this going, I think we were thinking about... We've got a longer-term vision about where we'd like it to go, but I think initially we're, we're looking at this volunteer basis, mm. uh, you know, for this academic year. And I think once we've got these initial uh, volunteers having gone through some coaching, then... I think what we re what we're hoping is that they will tell their colleagues. And we've also that one. got, um, you know, we've got some mid year training coming up, and and I think that's going to be an opportunity to to do some sharing. Mm. We need to think how we're going to set that up, but I think okay. if we've got some uh, people, some coaches and some coaches talking about how it's really worked for them on the ground, mm -hmm. then we're hoping that that positivity around it, I think, will, will lead, 
lead others to to want to get involved. But I think the essence is that it that it's about volunteers, isn't yeah, it? It's absolutely. about people wanting to be coached because you can't do it otherwise. No. It's something else. Yeah, it's like mentoring or or yeah. something. So I think you know, I, I think we've just got to be in it for the long haul. Yeah. Uh, so yeah. time is time is the essence. And you need to take the time to make yeah. sure that over time yeah. your coaches are secure in the skills that they have. Yeah. Now, what would you like me to do next and how would you like me to support you? And what shall we do about our next meeting? Yeah. What would be the best in terms of when and how you would like yeah. to meet again? Well, I think if we could give it a couple of months, that would yeah. be useful. Uh, I know I can come and see you, mm. uh, uh, you know, pop in and see you. But I think if we're going to meet more formally and, and do a review, I think if we've got a couple of months, uh, that'd be useful. It'll, it'll give time for me to have observed some of the, the, the coaches working with coaches. Mm. Um, it'll give us time to have more of our mini meetings so that they can be telling us how they think it's going. Yeah. And it'll give me time to have planned for and will have done that sort of, you know, that, that uh, internal in-service day we've got. Uh, where we can we can be promoting it Brilliant. through testimonies, if you like. Yeah, lovely, yeah. lovely. Well, that's perfect, isn't it? Two months, we yeah. can really focus in on what you've achieved over those two months. Yeah. Um, and yeah. and well done. You're really doing a great job with these volunteers. Yeah, I'm, Thank you. I'm pleased. Yeah. Thank Thanks you very much. Me. Yeah, very good. Excellent. Thanks.